It's Andrew Cuomo's last day in office as governor before Lieutenant Governor Kathy Hochul takes over at midnight. News Channel 34's Karina Capabianca has more on the governor's outgoing message and future plans. The governor's farewell address was a mixed bag. He gave advice for the future direction of New York State, but also used the time to blast the attorney general's report on sexual harassment allegations against him. When government politicizes allegations and the headlines condemn without facts, you undermine the justice system. The outgoing governor described the attorney general's report that found sexual harassment allegations against him credible as a political firecracker that resulted in a political and media stampede. But he said if he did not resign, it would cause governmental paralysis. He wished incoming governor Kathy Hochul well, and he rattled off advice, calling for teachers to be vaccinated, mask requirements in high-risk areas, and the control of crime. I disagree with some people in my own party who called to defund the police. I believe it is misguided. I believe it is dangerous. According to the governor's secretary, Melissa DeRosa, he has no interest in running for office again, but is exploring a number of options. In a statement, she said between HUD, AG, and his time as governor, Andrew Cuomo has spent nearly 25 years in public service, and the way he does it, it's 24 hours a day, seven days a week. DeRosa also noted he'll be spending time with family and fishing. In Albany, Karina Capabianca.